Hey Tankers, Bunza Duck here. Today we have Night Dog from the GFLC clan. He's in his 50 TP. He's on El Halouf in a standard battle in a tier 9, tier 8, tier 7 game. Ooh, top tier heavy. 50 TP, I mean, oy. It's a, <laughs> it's a, it's a strange tank. Um, and strange by that, I mean, it's, it's got this, this huge, massive brain of a turret, uh, which is fairly bouncy. Although if you can get into the lower area here you can do some serious damage and obviously jam up the turret uh the frontal armor is not the best in the world but it's great in a hold down scenario um anyway uh night dog's been grinding the 50 tp moving on to the 60 tp i just got to my 50 tp and so far i've had some pretty good games in it i've been i've enjoyed it um but um you know what can you say it is it's got a boomstick of a gun can do some serious damage can bounce some good has some fairly you know good decent turret armor uh even though it's um it's hull armor is not the best but it's not it's not terrible um so all around you know fairly good tank you know a fun grind i should say uh the 53 tp is, is just absolutely enjoyable um, but anyway, uh, Night Dog spawned over in the, what is that, the northeast, and he's headed over here to the, to the, to the big heavy area, and, and the choice to be made here is does he make this turn and go up on top of the hill and use the gun depression of this tank and, and the turret armor, or does he push around to the other big heavy area? What's he facing? Well, he's facing a Type 4 heavy, which is nothing to sneeze at. Uh, the IS-22 and the VK-101, I think those are his big threats. The 26E5 can obviously do some damage, and he, as, as could the, the T-29. Now, I haven't seen this replay yet, so we're going to see it together. So, Night Dog, take it away. He's getting a little push from his Comet friend. Night Dog's making the left-hand turn, along with the 54 Mod 1. It looks like the uh, IS-22 and the 26E5. Oh, goodness gracious, we got a bat chat who's just pushed up. He's been very aggressive. But he is, a, he is a tier 9, and he can lay down some serious damage if his clip is loaded. Which, by the way, he's not being overly aggressive. I would say his clip is just finishing reload. <laughs> But that bat chat is he's in a position where you either have to you know be fairly aggressive towards him which means you might take some shot oh hit the dirt but you blocked spotted a waffle tracker now that's not a tank to mess around with td i mean he can do some serious damage to you So the opposing team has been quite aggressive, right? They've taken, the, they've, they've posted up here in the, the B1 area, Bravo 1. They got a WT over here in, in the, the, the B1 on the backside of this hill. You got a batch hat down here who's keeping everybody lit. Uh, type 4 heavies over here on the Charlie 1. And you got a IS-2226E5 and it looks like a, a, oh, a T29 over here on the hill. Whereas um, Night Dog's team is, they, they've kind of gotten stalled. The Comet pushed through, but he's in a bad situation. Uh, they've got a Conway over here who's got shots on these guys if they come around the corner, but he's also in a pretty tough situation because he could easily be shot. Um, and it looks like, like I said, uh, Night Dog's team just got held up over here. And then you got an IS-3A over here who's playing Overwatch. Okay. <laughs> We'll just let that one go. All right, so now I'd be careful, Night Dog, coming out the way you are, uh, simply because you're opening up your side shots. And if that guy, even even the IS-22, even though with its 100 millimeter gun, can can you know get you tracked and and do some serious damage to you on that side, you know, coming in from the side like that. And there's a, a missed opportunity on the TVP BTU. Now we're into the reload, another 12.31 seconds. And like I said, this is this tank is running the uh, 130 millimeter with a 560 alpha. 
And a critical hit. I hate those. <laughs> All right. If he fires the gold, he can get into a, uh, a 303 penetration. Normally, he's at uh, 250. And there you go. All right. So, doesn't carry a ton of ammo. Um, you're out of the, the standard shells, and now you're into the gold. And they are pushing. Oh, my Lord, are they pushing. I had a nice shot into the back of that turret, and oh goodness gracious. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is a. Uh, this is almost like broken arrow time. <laughs> um, the red team has taken control, map control. Uh, the comet is over here doing, I don't know what he's doing. The type 4. The Type 4 Heavy's pushed through, and now he's just going to obliterate that Comet if he ever gets a shot on him. Uh, you got an IS-22, TBPBTU, the Centurion 1, the Bat Chat 25. Here comes the Lonely T-29. I mean, they have pushed into you guys. Let's see how it goes. My dog falls in behind the Mod 1. Trying to put, just pushing back and take that shot, which was probably smart. Oh, takes another chunk off of that T25, that Bat Chat 25 TAP. And, and you and the 54 Mod 1 are getting tied up. Oh, missed that shot. Now Night Dog is going to have to play in a in a in a precarious situation. I mean, he's it, he's got to play peekaboo. Oh, tracking shot in the twenty six e five. Just work on not showing your side armor. That would be the best bet. Oh, no, oh, good ball, goodbye. Uh, so much for the uh, what was that? WZ one twenty. It's down. Your team is holding the corner over there, which is good. That's allowing you to get in here and do some damage. You held that corner. The 54 Mod 1's back. That is 3A. He's still back there, along with the standard B. I mean, they're ready to help you. All right, you take down the Bat Chat 25. All right, now they're, they're just pushing in on you. They've just outgunned you. The Type 4 Heavy's in, 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 the, in the middle of all your tanks. So yeah, you got to change the fight. Got to somehow get behind them. Puts a shot on the Centurion 1. Sucks him down to 50, 58 hit points. And now he's moving in to get in behind these guys. Right, looks like the mod one's able to take out the 50 the centurion one so that's helpful you got the waffle tracker who's trying to come in and I think he wants to he, he definitely wants to get a piece of you oh nice shot into the back of his head he's turned around for the mod one mod one takes him out all right so you and the 54 mod one have been able to turn this battle around at this point, now you guys are in behind him. As long as the standard B and the AT and the IS-3A, who's, I don't know what he's doing, can keep them from pushing up any further, you guys can get in behind him. Now, hang on, the four, is he looking at you? He is. You got a tracking shot. Build your driver. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Use that dead, that dead hull. Oh, nice, nice shot into the, into the commander's hatch of that Type 4. Looks like, oh, the IS-22 is coming in behind you. He's coming in behind you. Oh, yep, and he double whacked, double tapped you, it looks like. <laughs> but you managed to take him out. Nice work, nice work. All right, so... That leaves the TVP, who takes a small chunk off you, and now he's on the run. 
Here comes your standard B. He's finally getting into the game. I guess he's been in the game. He's got five kills. Oh, goodness gracious. EVP takes a big hit and bounces his shot. I think he just rattled his whole crew. There's the 25 AT. Here comes the standard B. Looking for his sixth kill. And, oh, man, he night dog gives it to him by missing that shot. That's a victory. All right, well, you got a first class, bruiser, arsonist, duelist, fighter, fire for effect, and Spartan. Oh, 98,270 in credits, 8,784 in experience. And I have a feeling this is going to be a costly game because you, you have very little AP and you went a lot of APCR. But... You did 4,529 in damage, got four kills for a base XP of 1,301. Nicely done. Fired 18 shots, of those 13 hit, and of those 9 penetrated. You did block 560, and you spotted 11, or 1,109. Like I said, it was a costly game, but you made good experience. Um, you know, I seriously, I thought maybe you guys were dead once they were able to push into the middle of that upper... Uh, heavy area and then start coming over the hill at you i thought for sure that was it but you were able to fall back far enough and your team was able to hold on around that corner long enough to allow you to whittle those guys down and push them back they uh you know the standard b and the uh, is3a back there in the back the, i mean as soon as tanks start coming over that hill they have shots on them as long as you guys can keep them lit so you uh, you were able to force them back over that hill, which allowed you to come up and you and that 54 Mod 1 to get in behind. Brilliant, brilliant decision. Get in behind those guys and then start willing them away. So uh, very good play. Very, very good play. So that's Night Dog from the GFLC Clan and his 50 TP on El Haluf in a standard battle. If you liked the video, hit the like button. Keep those videos coming. I greatly appreciate it. Please remember to hit the subscribe button. This is Bonsai Duck out.